Now going into the dealer expo, this is a question I get hit up with a lot. Dalen, what's going on with Dalen? What happened to Dalen? Where are they? Who are they? You know, I don't know. It's, uh, I'll probably get two or three people uh, ask me about Dalen at the show this year. So I just want to talk a little bit about it. Uh, we have some of the manuals. Uh, the company kind of closed here in Miami and disappeared. We don't have the PDFs for these. Uh, it's going to take some time to scan them and put them online. But we have a few manuals. Um, unfortunately, a lot of them are in Korean. And before I even get, I'm getting ahead of myself here. Um, I'm jumping around. Dalem is a great brand. It's been around for years in Korea. They do extremely well in Germany and some other countries in Europe. Uh, it's high quality. Uh, we put them up there with Japanese and Taiwanese. It's a second tier brand because it's Korean. It's pricier than Chinese. A lot of people thought they were in the same league as the pricing. They're not. They're ex more expensive. Hence one of the reasons during the downturn, Dalen Motors uh, USA here based here in Miami, a few blocks from us, went out of business because it was more expensive. The parts are also more expensive. Um, the last two years, we have been unable to secure um, a good working relationship with them. According to Scoot Magazine, uh, Josh Rogers attempted to visit these guys, and they had just fired half their staff uh, last year because of the downturn in Korea. So it might be a reason why Dalen doesn't answer emails anymore. Um, the English speakers that actually were pre-fluent over there aren't there anymore. So that's as much as information as I got on Dalem. I'm sorry. I, we worked with the company. Uh, unfortunately, some things, sometimes businesses don't work out. And the owner continues to import and distribute Dalem in Argentina, but he's left the U.S. Um, supposedly, he's having a lot of good luck in Argentina because they have a booming scooter economy. So uh, it makes perfect sense why you would want to leave the U.S. during a bad economy. Um, you know, a lot of Argentinians came to Miami and opened up businesses when the economy was bad in Argentina. They go back to Argentina when the economy is good. So that leaves a lot of U.S. consumers and dealers looking for parts. As you've seen in our warehouse, we've done our best to stock and distribute some of the Dalem parts. Uh, Dalem is now a dead brand. It's an orphan brand. There's a couple thousand units out there, still some units on dealers' floors, a lot at the rental stores, and dealers have a hard time finding parts. Uh, we have parts. The hard time, what we're experiencing is uh, we have a lot of parts, but sometimes they're not the parts that dealers need. And a lot of dealers don't have or misplace the manuals, these manuals that we have here. We only have a few. We don't have all of them. Um, the ones we have, we can help you. The ones we don't have, you got to send us a picture. Email us a picture. We'll try to see if we have it in the warehouse for the bikes. Unfortunately, a lot of this is in bad English, uh, and it's in Korean. But we will do what we can. There's no new importer right now for Dalem. Um, a couple of the former employees went to work at dealerships. Some of them have parts. Some of them import a few parts. Uh, right now, we don't have any news on the new importer. I wish we did, and that's probably one of the questions we're going to get hit up with at the show this year, so I just wanted to answer it and be able to send you guys a link. Um, I'll show you the parts in the warehouse. We have a ton of them, but we don't have any body plastics. Uh, those are expensive to stock, and nobody stocks them. Uh, we have to do the engine parts, so pistons, cylinders, variators, belts, a lot of hard to find everyday items we do have for Dalem. Body plastics we're not going to stock. And that's my update on Dalem. Hopefully a new importer will come and we can work with them. That's that's our mission here at MRP. All right. Hope that helps you guys. Um, that's the most information I have.